Hey y'all, Coach Nefi here, giving our praise and honor to our Father in Heaven. Hallowed be His name, and getting prepared for the Feast of Weeks. This verse jumped out at me while listening to Proverbs chapter 3, talking about verse 9 and 10, that's talking about the first fruits of that increase. The way I read this, you can see it there on the screen, but the way I read it, it is the way we do first fruits or according to the way we do our first fruits is the way that we can expect to get these plenteous barns and these full wine presses of wine and such. They go hand in hand. Now, it's been a long time since I studied logic many years ago where they taught us how to make proper arguments. I don't remember all of the uh, ifs and thens and all of that, but I could entertain the argument by those who would say that we could and may only get our blessings, at least the blessings of wine and grain, when we do our first fruits, when we honor the Lord with our substance, when we honor the Lord with our first fruits, the first fruits of that increase. Well, that's what the Feast of Weeks is all about. It is a first fruits celebration. Of course, Tabernacles is the latter fruits. But here in this feast, we're talking about first fruits. And so I believe that Proverbs chapter 3 is talking about the Feast of Weeks or the Feast of Pentecost and how we're supposed to use our increase, our substance, in order to honor our Father. In other words, bring those in and use what our Father has blessed us with in order to bring glory and honor to his name, to the name of our Father in heaven. Hallowed be his name. So I just thought I'd share that with you. If you got anything out of this video, hit the like button. If you didn't, hit the dislike button. But leave us a comment either way. And shalom.